Welcome to Dips in the Scoop, where we get the inside scoop on creative entrepreneurs doing their thing. It's your Quentin, boys. your boy Q. Uh, we've got some very special guests on this week's episode. If you would please introduce yourselves, tell your names, and then uh, what you guys represent. After you, sir. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. My name is A Double L, also known as Ayante. I'm half of Mind's Eye, just as groovy as the other half. Um, I play bass. I sing. You know, keep it real casual. How about you, sir? What's your name? Oh, me? Oh, I'm Brad West, uh, part uh, creator of Mind's Eye. Um, I play guitar and bass, and we just like to gig. We just like to throw <laughs> shows and have a good time. <laughs> Showcase other people's arts and talents and yeah. make sure they're having a good time while they do it. Correct. Very dope, very dope. So where are you guys from? Rancho Cucamonga. Yeah, <laughs> yeah Rancho Cucamonga. <laughs> we could just settle on that yeah, general sure. location. <laughs> dope. Yeah. Back so, uh, like, what's your guys' background in? Both of you guys are, you're doing music. Like, kind of, where did all this start? How'd you guys meet? Let's start with that, actually. We were just talking about this earlier. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> natural disaster class. It's sophomore year of high yeah? school. Yeah? A natural disaster class? It's like the most boring class ever. But <laughs> That's a yeah. crazy class. Met him wow. there. Had a good little squad. Um, and we also yeah. had a drama class together the yeah. same year. Same year. Yeah, so it was like That's second true, period yeah. was like natural disaster, and then sixth was drama, drama. drama. Yeah. What's yeah. Up? Wow. Just strengthen that bond, you yeah. know? That's um, so crazy. Yeah. I don't even remember how the initial conversation started, uh -huh. but once it, it went, it just went. Like every day we were talking to each other, trying yeah. to figure out how we were going to. Just plans for the future, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah. Literal plans. Did you guys for the kind of like always have a, a feeling that it would lean towards music? Or like, how did that kind of like creative journey develop where you guys like, you know, you met each other and you're like, okay, you're cool, you're cool too. Like, let's mm. build but kind of what kind of gets you, got you on the path that you guys are on now he always played music mm -hmm. when i met him he was a he was a guitarist oh. and so that i've always had an admiration for an instrument yeah and the fact that he played guitar as soon as i met him yeah um and also he had a lot of other musical friends at the time that i weren't aware of yeah and so once our circle got a little bit bigger essentially they brought me into the world mm. of music that's dope and so it started with his guitar yeah and he put me on drums yeah which i had a natural knack for uh -huh. he just could play i was that's like cool. this kid could play wow. like he just, just went in so yeah. yeah we would jam and um yeah it wasn't always music though it was yeah. more of just like a broad spectrum of Real. like Creating. we just want to create yeah, yeah exactly so i feel like it stemmed from theater arts class too that was a huge part of it just being able to be creative every day for mm -hmm. school especially yeah. in high school which is, is hard you know yeah. But, yeah um so yeah just being able to like express ourselves that way and mm -hmm. then also through music later on too so yeah yeah that's cool so like Whoa. tell me a little bit about mind's eye and how that kind of came about <laughs> oh, i came about from the track day yeah. oh, honestly man, yeah so like day. Uh, senior year we had a uh, weight training yeah and it was like the teacher was so cool we would just be like yo mr gilbert can we walk the track mr like, gilbert yeah. shout out <laughs> mr gilbert shout yeah out mr. Gilbert. Shout out mr gilbert yeah <laughs> and yeah and he's like yeah go ahead and we would just walk and talk and like i feel like the faster we talked and like the more hype we got we were like walking yeah. all faster so we get yeah. we get so hype about yeah. our ideas maybe walk like four or five laps in a time span of four yeah on a move just gigging and just like ideas would stem and we're just kind of like manifesting things and we didn't know it was mind's eye until about like a few years ago like yeah. 20 2017 yeah, and dope. um but yeah Real. but yeah it's Real. always kind of been the idea but then we put a name to it around 2017 that's awesome yeah wow yeah that's so real <laughs> yeah could you give me or uh give i guess us in the audience like a a better idea of like what what mind's eye is and like what do you guys are you know trying to accomplish with it for you <laughs> for me yeah the way i see it is mine's art mine's art mine's eye is an art collective that brings artists groups of people anybody mm. to a centralized location to mm. help push out whatever influence they have whether it's it music um, visual art, artwork um even material like clothing yeah something as small as that yeah which we bring that and push it out that's cool that's what i see mine's eye collective as. that's so yeah yeah, and it's just it like all of that, and it's just like 
I just realized how hard, like moving to LA, mm -hmm. you know, I was in San Francisco for a while and like moving yeah. to LA, it's like how hard like the big businesses are for art to yeah. like, tap into it. And for so sure. it's just like, why not make our own platform? That's you know, it's like host our shows and, yeah. and get people together and like, you know, just that's like, cool. gatherings are my, like, that's my shit. You that's know? Cool. I love gatherings. Yeah. <laughs> for the people. My yeah. eye is for the people. That's dope. So you yeah. guys, it's like, uh, it's like curating and creating a platform exactly. for people at the same time yeah that's really dope yeah. we want people to feel comfortable no matter what type of art form they are creating and pushing out yeah we want them to know that there's a space for them and a solid platform for them to just start come and make shit yeah come through yeah art. <laughs> yeah and thank you for uh having us come and vendor at that last mind's eye event yeah, because yeah. like that was really dope um Check out Mind's Eye. They're hosting constant events, but like when we come through, it was very extremely well put together. You guys got like a dope venue. Thank you. Everyone who performed was really good. Uh, like everything uh, was yeah. really on point. The artists who came through was super dope. Shout out dope. to all the artists yeah. there. Yeah. yeah. Everybody. Seven, seven hour, we were very impressed when we came through and I was like, oh yeah, you guys are really doing it. Like yeah. this is dope. So it's really cool to see that you guys are like. My mom loved you guys. Oh she yeah. Like, yeah, yeah your mom's like, hella tight. She's like, <laughs> she's, she's like, I bought some stuff. She's like, yeah. she balled out that night. That's yeah. so cool. <laughs> no, yeah. but the events that like uh, for us being able to see that that was just super dope because it's like okay, you guys are really like this is really something. You guys are really putting something together. It's really dope. Yeah. Thank you for being there. Yeah, oh, yeah no. thanks for being a part energy. of it. Yeah, yeah, thanks for having. Us. That was our first Anytime. big one. Like yeah. we uh, first first technically like it was uh, on my birthday. Yeah. In my backyard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then we were like, all right, let's just do it bigger. Yeah, let's yeah. Do it bigger. You know? That's and cool. Then, yeah. So then we uh, we were like, all right, let's get a venue. You That's know? so dope. And it all came together like there was like. Uh, like a few weeks before we we're like all right where are we gonna have this like what are we gonna do then, <laughs> and it came to the crunch time yeah, uh -huh. it just works itself out though yeah we were just like, you gotta put the work in we yeah just gotta <laughs> if we're gonna do it we just gotta do it so this is us doing it. Yeah. yeah did you find that like setting the hard date was like what really kind of like got the shit going i think that was honestly the easiest because it was yeah. like mind's eye all right 2020 2020 yeah. vision let's, yeah you know, let's like, just click it yeah. yeah and then so january 4th that was like the first weekend of january so yeah. we like let's kick off this just year right dope. You know? what yeah. a better way than to be hosting yeah. you guys on a van exactly that's excellent yeah man <laughs> yo we did that bro. yeah <laughs> no you guys really really did that shit. that was really tight wow hey shout out to christian jorans for these designs though beautiful they were a hit at the show they yeah were yeah at the show yeah you guys everything's really well put together um what are some like inspirations i guess you would say or like um yeah like what are some inspirations that kind of like either who you look to for ideas or kind of like really inspired you guys to like make the jump and just start doing the shit mm, uh so i have to say all my friends all my family hands down some of the deepest inspiration mm -hmm. but at the end of the day when i sit down and i'm in my studio and i'm just thinking mm -hmm. it's like it's my brother brad yeah he's some of my number one inspiration that's it's cool like his his aura and his musical talent inspires me so heavy wow. that i create in a different mind space that's and so I just, dope i want to open that up to everybody else out there so that they see yeah that no matter what inspires them they can still do what they love and create and they yeah. can still create to inspire others that's hella fire yeah like, big yeah big inspiration would just honestly like it stems from the feeling of it like mm -hmm. it was like Real. oh that felt so great like yeah. let's do it again yeah you know? that's like, so cool um but yeah, other than just solely music and and acting mm -hmm. and um and just painting too, like yeah. just from all that, it's just like all right, why don't we like multimedia thing going just do on, it on, you know? Yeah. And like if we can provide that platform slash space to do it, then yeah, let's you know winning, yeah, yeah, <laughs> winning. No, yeah that's yeah. dope. And it's funny because like our very first event was just done like at our friend's house in San Jose <laughs> and it was just like in the living room we had a bunch of but it was the same similar experience where it's like oh this turned out pretty well like yeah. this is pretty dope we could do this and then we got a venue the next time and like it just as it's up. just gonna yeah, yeah you guys are gonna be able to do you guys brought had a lot of people come through too it's gonna be dope I'm excited <laughs> did, for you guys yeah, yeah. People come like it was, it was a very successful event thank you thank um, you so wow. like <laughs> Do you guys have any mentors helping you with this? Or are you guys just kind of like total DIY, just doing your own? Just Yoda. My yeah. sister, you can't see her, but she's back there. She's <laughs> my number one mentor. Um, <laughs> you know, she's my right hand. I call her like 
number one question, Otolo wants yeah. to move. Like, yeah. you, how would you go about this? Shout out to you. Shout out to you. <laughs> Otolo. Um, but I would say she's she's my number one mentor. Don't. She's my number one mentor. What about you, Brad? How you feeling? Uh, mentors. Um, not at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, like, I don't know. It's just like I was saying, just coming from, like, the feeling and just the having just the want to yeah. do it, you know? Yeah. And, and like the support from family and yeah. just and friends and my boy right here yeah like i could not be doing it without him and also shane thank shane. you shane oh my god like he Shout comes, out shane. yeah he was one of the guys he was just Shout he out. is big part of mine mine's yeah. like, he like helped us first show and second show so mm -hmm. much like he is just been there like anything we need look at Shane he's right Shane, there he's yeah, right there. Like, you know, yeah. sound engineer yeah energizer bunny whatever Shane is the and guy and then performing for got everyone wow. hyped yeah everybody was talking about this guy when he yeah. got off stage like who is this man with all this energy that's so he's an animal yeah <laughs> he's an animal <laughs> he is an animal yeah that's very cool shout out to Shane aka Shanyo the Hessian we see you we love you and we appreciate you bro three to five years from now like mm -hmm. where would you guys like hope to take this or do you guys have that vision clear yet or you guys are still building yep. so much that you're like nah. yeah yeah um, this will be a festival yeah, yeah. that's dope. and i don't want it like because like, yeah festival maybe just because that documentary fire festival oh like, yeah, oh, yeah. We're about to make a yeah, festival, yeah. Guys. Like, we're about to not trying to be the fire fest not guys not rule. yeah not, not bring fucking you trust us you can trust us yeah, yeah. <laughs> then we won't take your money until you no jaw no jaw rule involved <laughs> yeah no jaw rule <laughs> but um yeah i mean i guess i don't know just maybe i want like a word more than a festival yeah but, you know but like something yeah we're just display your art like hang out and i mean like Lightning in the bottle is like one of the coolest things that I've, I haven't even been, but I just know all of the, Wait, yeah, all of the, the, the things that they offer there. And I yeah. feel like that is like one of the things that I kind of aspire to do. Yeah. You know? So that's yeah. incredible. So like ultimately, like it'd be really dope. You guys would like to like create a festival almost type thing. Yeah. Well, like grow it to the point something where it's like, better. yeah, something yeah. even better. Like just a really powerful, like yeah. event, Space. consistent event. Yeah. yeah. Wow. My That's goal, super dope. My number one goal for the Mind's Eye 2020 vision was to create a space, to build a space, excuse mm -hmm. me, and just have people come through and be able to converse with yeah. people they don't know. Mm -hmm. And I achieved that goal. Yeah. We achieved that goal on mm -hmm. such a huge spectrum. Yeah. Because I was seeing random people mm -hmm. associate with my group. My, yeah. Like old school group of friends. Yeah. Different people yeah. talking to different people. That's so cool. And that right there was one of my biggest inspirations because it's like nowadays everybody's so focused on a phone mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and everybody that was there was wanted to be there yeah engaged, engaged. yeah so everyone was like, engaged all the art on the there were always eyes flowing around because there was so much influence on the walls from the different artists yeah and so i just want to be able to continue to curate a space mm -hmm. with yeah, yeah. special people that yeah. understand the same thing and just want people to have fun and that's, enjoy that's themselves. yeah that's like a huge point where it's like so having parties like i was always like <laughs> yeah <laughs> so having, having parties yeah. having parties like at like 15 like i loved i love gatherings and yeah stuff, you know and then but that's what's so nice about this it's more than just a party it's yeah. so much more come see art and like mm. that immediately the artists help like people engage yeah. with each other you know that's what i mean true. they help like people hang out that's and talk cool. who would never talk before yeah so, and everybody was saying that like all of the show they're just like oh my god this is amazing like, i feel like i t could talk to anyone that's bounce dope. anywhere and yeah. feel comfortable so that's yeah it. and shout out we to you guys that. for like creating a space because i think it, it is like when you're creating an event or like having people come to a space like the people who set up the space like mm -hmm. you kind of set the tone for what the energy of the space is and the people who you yeah, invite over tough. set the energy so like a big reason why everyone who went there fell is because you guys set it up so nice mm -hmm. and the types of people that you had invited like everyone was kind of on like a, a chill good energy like yeah, this kind of yeah. open-minded energy and that's why mm -hmm. even though it's so many strangers everyone was able to like to interact and communicate friendly. it was like yep. a safe dope space so yeah. like yeah that that's really cool real. we did that man yeah, yeah. felt yeah. real good it felt so good <laughs> yeah yeah i took a step back and saw everybody and i was like wow yeah 
Um, so many beautiful people. What would you say that mind's eye represents? Like your yourselves and mind's eye together, what would you say it all like represents? Or what's like the takeaway you hope people would get after coming to an event or experiencing something that you guys have created? Like, what do you hope that people kind of take away from it? You go first. Mainly, I think uh, it's just like, uh, it's your vision. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? It's like, it's it's what you, you want to do. So like achieve it. Like mm -hmm. we just want to just support and be there and yeah. have like the opportunities wide open. You That's know what cool. I mean? Because it's like, it's not easy to do, especially with like a day to day job. And yeah. like you lose track of mm -hmm. all of like what you want to do. And it's just like, for sure. Yeah. And you just like, we want to just like help that. Dope. Yeah, like because we need art, you know. What yeah, I mean? we need no, more I agree. Art. Like, stay for me, I would have to say the feelings of invoking because if you can invoke something, mm. then that means you're inspiring change. Yeah, and to me, that's really at the end of the day what mind's eye is. Yeah, because it changed my life. Yeah, hands down. that's so, and I just I want to keep pushing that. I want to invoke that into other people, so yeah, that they can be everything that they are meant to be yeah and that's 100%. something i've been thinking about a lot too recently too is just like the power of impact and the fact mm. that we can like as people we have this ability to impact each other and like you could change someone's life through like a moment or through yeah. an experience mm -hmm. i think it's just so incredible that we have this ability to like impact each other in a way that like it can inspire or enlighten and it's yeah so shout out mind's eye that's dope i really Thanks, i fuck with you guys yeah. very shout cool out to dip for hosting yeah shout us. out to dip yeah <laughs> kindness um so we'll be on to our final question you guys have been doing excellent by the way great answers great energy thank you a plus good. everything great question yeah <laughs> thanks we're getting Try. deep over here yeah knock 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 okay so final question um Dip's about being all in on your passion and taking it as far as you can go, growing with it, really just being all in. Uh, what advice would you give to the next creative or the next entrepreneur or person who's trying to pursue their passion? Um, yeah, what advice would you give to them? Let me hear that. Quick knowledge. <coughs> Don't stop. Yep. Yep. Forget what everybody else says. Yeah. At the end of the day, when it's you and it's your craft, don't stop that's mm -hmm. all you need people are gonna tell you you can't do it people are gonna support you throughout the way but no matter what don't stop don't you quit yeah just yeah keep pushing like mm. art is always there you always resort to it or always go to it first and then figure out the rest of the shit later like everything works itself out it yeah. does forward motion Yes. Thank you guys. Only. Yeah. Wonderful Don't answer. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Um, do What's you have a final question? Yeah. I just <laughs> wanted to ask you guys. Yeah. Is there anything you feel we could have did better at the show? Hmm. That's a good question. Hmm. Keep it real. You can't hurt my feelings. Trust no, me. actually, I mean, you guys had it extremely tight. I'm thinking of like, like any. It was dirty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, no. It was disgusting. I'm thinking because I mean, you had you had drinks there, which made people happy. Having drinks at events is always that great. Was, Gets people cool. relaxed, a little loosened up. A little bit you guys did a really loose. good job. Like uh, the art was all set up nice. The organization of the space was nice. When the performances are going on downstairs, there's enough space for people to all come down and still be comfortable and there's enough space for people to come in and out it was very comfortable it was, it was very such smooth a good space. yeah it worked out extremely well like oh we we're saying God. that's crazy for that to have just been like your second like big one because it was very like it was enough to make <laughs> us think like oh they've been doing this for a minute you could yeah, tell yeah. this wasn't like a random some season like art yeah show yeah so you guys are definitely on the right track like uh, it's yeah. just expanding it and growing <laughs> it more but i don't even i don't think i have any negative feedback honestly thank yeah you, thank you, you killed you. it you did a good job thank you so Woo! much yeah so I shout just want to shout out a few people. Of course. Shane Montoya, Courtney Mace. That mm. was beautiful window art. Um, Christian Jones. She's Jorns. behind you in case you couldn't see her. Yee! I'm Give away. <laughs> she just slides out the way. <laughs> oh, I thought she was right there. No. She's Cor not right there. <laughs> she's not Courtney? right there. Court? Oh, Courtney? Oh, oh she's Court? Courtney? <laughs> 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 yes. Yo, shout out to Elaine, you were aka over there. E. She yeah. really came through. Shout out to Matt Mendoza. Yes, yes. Was, like, Thank you for all the help. Thank you, all the artists. Honestly, it meant so much for you guys being there. I Excellent. really don't think you guys understand how deeply we appreciate and the energy that you guys held. 
like that was real like we were there but we weren't there <laughs> you guys were there and you were like there you Maybe. know let's hear what he has to say about mind's eye 2020 vision yeah 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 word homie i feel the same way profound can't lie profound we're, we're mind's, mind's eye, eye. And yeah, we've we just did. dipped. <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, you can say it. we are dipped. It's easier. <laughs> we've just been dipped. Did we've just dipped. been dipped. All right. Yeah. All right. Okay, so. One, two, three. Hi, we're Mind's Eye, and we've just been dipped. <laughs> Yay! Yeah! And cut. That's a, that's a bingo. 